Guys, amazing job on this film. I knew that as soon as there's a dog involved, it was gonna get me right in the feels. But uh, <laughs> they do this movie a little bit differently. And Call of the Wild, I didn't even put this together. This is like eighth grade reading for me. I remember reading this book when I was a kid. So what attracted you to the project of Call of the Wild? I mean, this is a dream role of a lifetime for me. There's like everything, everything that could possibly attract you to a role attracted me to the role. I've got a great character to play. Harrison Ford, Omar C, you know? It's a dream, it's a dream. The the imagination, the the physical challenges sure. of the role were really fun. We got to play, we got yeah. to joke and laugh and it was a dream. Yeah. True. Now let's talk about that because uh, sledding is something that I don't think I'd be very good at. But let's talk about some of the challenges uh, in training that went into you guys being li looking like pro sledders out there, even though you guys were dispatchers. Right? <laughs> Pro. pro. Uh -huh. Straight up pros, yeah. Well, take it. <laughs> was that a difficult challenge, uh, learning how to do that stuff? Yeah, it was challenging. Yeah, of course. And, uh, and, and because it, it's 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 not um, easy because it, it, it goes very, very fast. Sure. And, uh, and the, 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 the main, um, I would say, issue about it is no dogs. There's right. No dogs. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so being a sled dog without dogs. Rope. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's so crazy. it was it was uh, uh, um, kind of um, uh, wondering at the at the beginning, but uh, but at the end, it's just it was like you said, like being in a in a in a roller coaster right. every day. Yeah. So it was it was so fun at the end. Now, one thing that you brought it up, there there aren't any dogs, and I love the fact that they kind of humanize the dogs with the looks mm. on their face because it makes yeah. them. Real characters, it feels like. Uh, can you talk to me about the challenges, either whether it be harder or easier, playing with no dogs, essentially? Yeah, well, we were very fortunate to have Terry Notary play Buck, and he was incredible. He's an incredible actor and an amazing human being. I, he gives us everything. Everything that you see Buck doing, he was doing really? those emotions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and I think there was, no way to do that without him because you cannot have that recreate the, the bond between between Buck and uh, Francoise and Perrault without that because a tennis ball cannot give you that. He 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 was sure. he was Buck, you know, and uh, looking into your eyes and have that connection, you cannot recreate that. There's something is has to happen, right. and uh, mm -hmm. and uh, hopefully we we had him. And now, the first part of this movie, uh, you guys are very impactful with Buck's uh, training, we'll say, and his affection towards humans. Talk to me about how your guys' characters play uh, with Buck's storyline. Well, I think that sort of the function of these characters in the context of the story is that uh, Buck bounces off of us to become a better version of himself. So yeah, sure. you said it, that we're like the mom and dad. Yeah. I think that's so that's a it. Great point. Yeah. yeah, yeah, and they give him the confidence to to move forward and become who he has to become. And uh, mm -hmm. and I think we we all need that in our lives, you know. And um, and uh, and uh, we are so happy and proud to 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 be to be to be that for him. Yes. And we are so proud because because we saw we saw um, his babies, you know. Yeah. And uh, that's true. Yeah. So. Yeah. We're it's proud. Good. proud. We are proud. Yeah. We're grandparents. Grandparents, grandparents now. <laughs> <laughs> now, Omar, it was just announced earlier today from the Hollywood Reporter that you're going to be appearing in Jurassic World Three. Yes. Uh, can you talk to me about your excitement about reteaming with Colin Trevorrow on in, in that world? I'm Congratulations. so congratulations, yeah, by the way. So you know what? I'm so happy to uh, to to to, co to come back and uh, to uh, to to work with uh, Colin again because he's a he's an amazing um, uh, film director and. Uh, He's a he's a he's a cool guy. I love his uh so wait the thing he's a, he's a genius for me. He's very 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 smart and talented. I'm so happy to to work again with Chris Pratt and um and just uh, I w I wanted to sing uh, real night and <laughs> yeah. I love it. I love it. Well, you guys did an amazing job on the Thank film. You. Thank you so much for your time. I appreciate Thank it. You. Thank, Thank you. you. Big pleasure. Thank you so much.